Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Amori. We beat up a SpaceX boyfriend, and now... I can press the correct button. E. This is under the wet pillow, I guess, so... E. Eight keys left. There is a hole here. Reach into the hole? You felt someone hold your hand. Interesting. A mark of anger and sadness. Cool. Well, I can see the footprints once again. We have a path forward. So let's go. Wait. My guy? What are you doing here? Dude, that's on you. Quack, Captain Space Boyfriend is back to normal. I gotta let Captain Pinkbeard know right away. Okay. Okay. Uh, the view here is spectacular. A band of space pirates has been camping out here for a long time now. I hear the captain suddenly decided he wasn't gonna travel anymore. Just to be sure, you're a super fan and whatnot. Is there anything changed in here? Yep, mm -hmm. yep, cat. I'm about done. Oh. Hello, everyone. How's the search for Basil going? Well, Mari, Mary, it seems that we've taken a little detour. Just trying to help those in need, you know? Look, Mary, I got a snow cone ticket. Well, that's very nice, Aubrey. Thanks. Mary, look what I can do. That's uh, very nice, too, Kel. I know, isn't it? So strange. We've searched all over the place, but we haven't seen a hint of Basil anywhere. Oh, Basil, I wonder where he could have gone. There must be something we're missing. Do you have any leads, Amori? Hi, Amori. Quick face as usual, I see. You should totally smile more. I've always liked your smile. So do you need do you need me to help you with anything? All it costs is your love. My love will violence. Oh. I didn't know this was a thing. Hmm. Basil. I've been thinking, maybe Basil had to go somewhere important in a rush. But where could he have gone, and why wouldn't he tell us about it? I just hope he didn't end up in any trouble and that he's somewhere safe. I've been thinking, maybe Basil... Oh. I guess. Okay. Daisy's Dilemma. Hey, you got a flower puzzle. Wasn't Daisy looking for one to give to her crush? It's pretty obvious who it is. <clears throat> it's Nep. <clears throat> uh, hey, you've got a... F oh. hey, yeah. Hector. Dang. Kel's pet rock Hector fell out of his pocket. Sorry, Kel. I'm not sure where he is, but don't give up. Hey, looks like you have everything that TV girl was asking for from her strange list. You should bring it to her. I'm sure she'll uh, make something amazing and strange. Alright. Let's go take care of those things. All of them. We're totally going to find Basil right now. Hey, TV girl. TV girl. Or whatever. Oh, sweet. You found everything on my list. I should ask random people for favors more often. Da, 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 da.
And voila. Ah, that hits the spot. My old coffee machine broke like forever ago, but I've been too busy to gather the missing parts. Now that this new one is all fixed up, I don't have to drink that gross instant coffee crap anymore. Here's a little something for helping me out. You got dynamite. This actually looks kind of dangerous. Ooh. Now if you'll excuse me, I, will have, I have some important business to attend to. Okay. Toy. Uh, dynamite. Actually dangerous. Deals heavy damage to all foes. I hope I won't be needing it. <laughs> I don't really plan on using it anytime soon. At some point, maybe during a boss battle, though I'm afraid of losing. But oh to well. Right. We have to go down, then over. And now, onwards to Snowmageddon. I'm Jasher, the many talented and master of many trades. How can I help you today? It seems you don't have enough clams. Bro, these snow cones are really good. The snow cone machine. Would you like to use a snow cone ticket? Sure. The snow cone machine dismisses the snow cone. What he did back there was really brave. I would never challenge the captain like that. You all would all make seriously awesome space pirates. It's so nice to have the captain back. Yeah, buddy. Dude, I can't believe the captain paid for all of our snow cones. <laughs> I'm so emotional right now. Ahoy, my guy. Here to have snow cones with us? My snow cone tastes like nothing. So many thoughts and emotions have been eating at me lately. But there's something very calming about this moment. I feel at peace. Very cute. Do I need a... button mash. Does this do anything? Why is there a trapdoor if I'm not allowed to use it? You're right, you should just type in Memento Mori. Huh? Oh, it needs batteries. That's probably related. Okay. Totally. Dead by Daylight reference. Totally. So if I find some batteries at some point, I can come back and do that. Too bad I've only found dead batteries thus far. I just need a password for that door up there. Alright. Still can't go down there. Hey Pluto! Double checking this does lead down the ladder. Basil? We'll deal with that in a minute. And that is absolutely Basil Sprite. I'm just missing the flower crown, I think. Let's head back to the vast forest for now. You're right, that's Bagel, not Basil. We have a couple things here we need to do. Whoa. 
Is that a flower puzzle for me? Maybe Neb will finally notice me now. Oh no, I said his name. Please don't pretend you didn't hear that. Thank you for the flower puzzle. Here's a gift in return. I picked a bunch of them earlier. Aren't they pretty? You got a daisy from Daisy. Aww. I wonder when I should give this to him. What does it do? Daisy. Heart plus ten. Where starts happy about Ooh. Hell yeah. Attack plus seven but reduced hit rate. Oh. Eye patch. The first step to becoming a pirate. So this has an advantage. The thing is that unless I were to find like a weapon that had better accuracy for someone, I don't know that I would really use it. I don't like missing. It sucks. Like, if I were to find Seer Goggles, for instance, it increases my hit rate. If I were to find a weapon that had low accuracy, Seer Goggles would be amazing, because typically if something has low accuracy, it has a good secondary effect. I just... I really don't like... Not, I, I don't like missing. RNG sucks. You're right, you should just use that crafting mechanic I totally have. Hey, Van, come here for me. Huh? Did you want something, Burley? Yeah, stand right there and look that way. Okie dokies. Aubrey, come here. Am I about to get a better headbutt? What do you want now, Burley? Aubrey! Aubrey, 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 Aubrey. What's with that sassy tone? Aubrey, Aubrey, Aubrey. Okay, that's what it is. Come on, we're best friends. Now, you see that big guy over there? I know who Van is. Great. Go on and give him a good whacking for me. What? Why? What if he gets hurt? Always with the questions. Can't you just do something without thinking for once? Go on, smash. Hey, where do you think you're running off to? Get back here. Fine. As for Aubrey, not you. Fine, fine, fine. Smash. Okay, there, I did it. Now what? Do it again. Do it until I say stop. Okay, but what am I doing exactly? No questions, only smash. You're getting somewhere, I think. Come on, you can do it. Stamina, stamina. How long do I have to keep doing this? Until I say stop. Don't slow down now. Nope, <sighs> oh, my arms feel like noodles. Keep pushing. You're almost there. I'm gonna pass out. Please, just one more smash. <sighs> yeah! Aubrey gained 50 juice. <sighs> what was that all about? Nah, nothing really. I was just bored. But honestly, this is pretty boring too. What? That's all? Hey, at least you got something out of it. I'm still bored here. Rumble, rumble. Come on, man. Let's play some tetherball. I just don't get Burly at all. <clears throat> I'm figuring that she just got 50 uh, juice. She's at 91 currently, so she's at the highest. Oh, yeah. It's you. Oh, her actual stats. Uh... 
Oh. Yeah. I, I noticed that she was low on everything. That's why I healed. Thing is, I was already low on a bunch of things, so it didn't exactly stand out to me. Alright, I'll deal with that another time then. Is it like visually, like I can tell something's weird about it? Or is this just gonna be a walk around and mash the A button kind of deal? Oh. Okay. Well, I figured out which tree, apparently. A big, strong tree. Did nothing. That's not good. So I can fight it again. The problem is that is this gonna be a case where I want to do this? Because as it stands. I guess what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna give this a shot, see if I can actually do anything to this. But I'm gonna. S okay. So I'm gonna go and see if I can do anything to this. I'm gonna go and save and whatnot. Friends feel like new. Okay, so if Aubrey is not currently able to damage, her first turn shouldn't be spent attacking. Um, just trying to think about how I want to do this. I think it was this trick. Yeah. Okay, so Amori rubber band. Annoy. Also a romance. Took 50 damage. 50 damage. Okay. Stabby, stabby. Uh... But rubber band again, and for the sake of maybe not dying, smile. Stabby, stabby. Red and heart. Aubrey still doesn't do anything. That's not good to hear. I mean, to be fair, headbutting a tree probably wouldn't do anything. But to be fair. It's very stupid that I'm doing it this way, but let's see if I can just kill rubber bands. Defense can't go any lower. Get crit on. Okay. Keep on stabby stabby. Um Question. Um If I were to make Amori more sad, would stab do more damage? Or is that not related? Is it just the sad status, period? 
because I've not made a Mori more than just the base level set. I've made a Manic before, but... I'll just give it a shot. I don't want to waste turns on it. I want to be dealing damage every turn. Here I am, beating up a tree. Amori feels depressed. Ooh. All right, now this is a good way to test it. Stabby, stabby. Uh... Plum juice. Curveball. Uh, cook, I guess. Yeah. Oh, you can't make the tree sad. What the hell? No, it doesn't seem to boost. Uh, maybe. Not sure. Fine, I'll read a sad poem. I feel it's miserable. Aww. That's sad. Stabby, stabby. It's also really weird that I always crit it if I stab it. But it is confirmed that Miserable doesn't seem to make, you know, any more damage from stabby stabby. Ignore his defense. Yeah. I, I I I realized that. Yeah. I more so meant like I I forgot that part, but I more so meant like it's weird that Oh right, the defense pierce. Yeah, okay, no. Never mind, I understand. Uh fucking More appy juice for you. And what you have to remember is that I am very tired, and I always am. I sleep like shit. Oh, Aubrey actually dealt damage. Wild. Warriors party was victorious. Gained 500 XP. Hello, Benoy.
So I beat up a tree. Aren't I so proud of myself? Let's check out the faux facts. The big strong tree. Wow, it's so big and strong, says Kel. Thanks, Kel. A relic of the past. It seems awfully cheerful despite its impending fall into obscurity. I used to collect these a while ago, so this is where they all went. An ancient form of access and communication networks. It makes a horrible ear piercing noise when used. All the sound reminds me of the good old days. The revived spirit of a boombox, a portable method of transporting loud noises. A mysterious boy obsessed with wind conditions. He is usually seen in the floating forest, flying his kite and mumbling something about the weather. A strange kite, it seems to possess a life of its own. The third planet from the sun, its surface is mostly covered in water and people. Error. The fierce alter ego of Captain Space Boy, Captain of the Space Pirates. He comes out when Captain Space Boy is angry, commands the plans of the solar system, but about the heart of no one. Neat. Alright. So let's get out of here now. Alright, I guess I don't need to get out of here. I can head up here. I forgot almost that, you know, I was going to the train station. Swat. The line starts here. We'll get up soon. Just give me a bit. H E L L O I A M T Z H E S P E L L I N G B E E E E E E Really? Come on. I can't stand talking to this bee guy. He's driving me nuts. Mom told me to put on a jacket because she thought it was going to be cold. Uh, it's so hot right now. But I don't want to take my jacket off. Because that, then I would have to hold it. Hot diggity dog. It's me, hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog. Ah, help! It's an ugly plant creature! Excuse you? I'm no plant creature, ugly plant creature. I'm a sprout mole, a very high functioning intelligent creature. What are you referring to as a lost sprout mole? When sprout moles become lost, they can often become hostile and attack without warning. I feel like that's the exact same thing that Hero told me. Hmm, actually, where am I? Could it be that I'm lost? Or suddenly I don't feel so good. That's funny. Realizes it doesn't know where it is, so it attacks. I've only seen the train run once, and that was years ago. Probably goes somewhere completely different now. When I wait too long, I get antsy. Gotta move, gotta move. If the line doesn't move soon, the guy next to me is going to get it. It's a blessing to exist. Thanks, Mountain. La 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 la. My singing makes the time pass faster for me and slower for everyone else. I don't mind waiting at all. Waiting's just a natural part of life. I need a fat stacks of cash. This long line is a perfect excuse for me to catch up on my beauty sleep. I always seem to find myself in precarious situations. I wonder if this counts. Jump, 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 jump. Been seeing the skater guys around here recently. That means the big boss is conducting business again. Huh? You haven't heard of the big boss? Well, you will soon. I spy with my little eye a rainbow umbrella thing with lots of legs. 
Yeah, I'm pretty fast, but not as fast as a train. It's important to know your limits. Oh, bye. Can you tell the guy in front of me to hurry up? Some of us has lives, you know? What tomfoolery is this? I demand you don't need to see my family at once. Do I look like a tom to you? Screaming in my ear ain't gonna make the train running faster, lady. I have to consider myself a pretty well-tempered jash. But if there's one thing I can't stand, it's line cutters. You know what I hate more than anything else? Bunnies. That's right. Bunnies. I just hate them so much. If I had one wish in the world, I'd destroy all the world's bunnies. Hey, look, okay, you've defeated a few bunnies. Yeah, that's right. I can tell how many bunnies you've defeated just by looking at you. That's how much I hate bunnies. Say, so, tell you what. Let's make a deal. If you defeat at least five bunnies, come back and report to me. I'll give you something nice. Now go on and destroy those bunnies. Oh, friendly, a fellow bunny hater. By looking into your eyes, I can see that you've killed 69 bunnies. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! 69! Splendid! I see you've destroyed more bunnies. That's 69 bunnies obliterated. Thank you so much, fellow bunny hater. You got a cotton ball. Hell yeah! Now go on and destroy more bunnies. Hello, fellow bunny hater. By looking into your eyes, I can see you've killed 69 bunnies. Splendid. I see you've destroyed more bunnies. 69 obliterated. Thank you so much. You got the bunny ears. Alright. I knew there was a reason I was doing this. I just didn't know why. No one told me. I just killed every bunny I saw. A rabbit foot? Okay. Bunny ears. Defense plus three, speed plus twelve. Hell yeah. Um speed plus fifteen, luck plus ten. And defense plus one, speed plus three. Okay, so helps you hear better. A little yucky, but keeps you lucky. A fluffy ball of cotton. This isn't gonna be a case where I put these on and he attacks me, right? That'd be very funny though. Um, this would be a straight up upgrade to my speed and luck. Thinking about it, I should probably... Well, I have the bad ending, so... Luck doesn't matter on Amori, now that I'm thinking about it, if I'm using the, st the stab strat. So instead, Kel, I'm gonna lower your defense. Because you have an attack that is based off your speed. Try to get more crits with Kel. happy, so I'm considering doing this. 
Yeah, Daisy. He deserves it. Isn't the air here nice? You can smell the queen. I'm on the way to conduct some important business. And then afterwards, I'll conduct more important business. Thanks, Fred. Good to know. Wookie gets down easily, but he just needs someone to listen sometimes, and that someone is me. Everyone here is so different and interesting. I wonder what makes me different and interesting. Oh boy, I'm in trouble now. Huh. What is it always got to be me? This ain't none of your business, kid. Be careful who you associate yourself with. I'm speaking from experience here. Trains aren't really my thing. I'm just here for the music. That's valid. Hi, kids. I'm Gibbs, the stationary musician. I used to be a traveling musician, but I left that life a long time ago. Would you like to spare five clams? That would... They would be a great help. Since I'm completely stationary, I'll show you something go would if you do. Sure. Thank you for your donation. Now return. Let me play the song of my people. Why does this just sound like K.K. Slider? I thought it was over, so I pressed A to try to get out of it. That went on lo longer than I thought it would. You thought the song was pretty good? Hell yeah. I didn't even notice this up here, to be honest with you. Popcorn. Where is this dimension? Yeah, okay. Paper cups full of lemonade. So can I not even go on the train today? Is that what I'm understanding? Because there's just people in the way. Squawk. Line starts here. back but I don't think this is gonna change yeah it seems like we can't because of this nonsense it's fine we'll take care of that tomorrow a tentacle is poking out of the ground So you know what would help? If I actually equip the skill. I'm not really using rebound right now. So run and gun. And that means that instead of 25 attack, he'll be using his 51 speed to attack. That's it. It's pretty good. Considering, uh... Let's see. 20 attack. 30 attack. Amori's doing a lot more damage than everyone else. 33 attack. Yeah. No one else is even close to that amount. 
But yeah, I need to kill some more Benoys. That way I get more Benoy stuff. I gotta dress up myself up like a sexy bunny. I mean, to be fair, it does sound like it would be ultra powerful. Alright, then I am done for now. Let's move on. Change who I'm sitting again. I mean, I checked him before I went in there, so I'm not gonna check him right now. I'm not gonna make my way all the way back there. Oh, the atmosphere is different. A tentacle is poking out of the ground. Run the go the way it wants me to. I'm gonna check up here. Watermelons are my favorite part of summer. Okay. cookies. Mary's cookies have much more love baked into them. I could eat them forever. A wish? Oh, what should I wish for? I have everything I could want right here. You going on ahead? Don't worry about us. We'll catch up in a minute. Still young. We should dream big, right?
this year, you get just one present from all of us. There's nothing here. I had a feeling that that would happen, but... Finally able to access the barn, huh? F to pay respects. Sheet music on a music stand. All the notes have been scribbled out. A happy family.